Okay, one second, please. One second, guys. Okay, so yes, all right, so we can go ahead. So like I was saying, if the market is not ready to pay you, you don't, you don't, you don't, you don't get agitated and just pick anything, no. If, it does not, if it's not ready to pay you, let it go. Move on to the next thing or you leave the market and come back. So this morning, we're going to be securing the bag, um, check what is happening in the market, and at the same time, we do some educating. So if you're new here, just pay attention. We do some educating. So my, my process is usually learn and earn. So I explain every process as I start, as I go ahead. I explain every of the steps. All right. So I'll go ahead to share my screen now. I'll go ahead to share my screen. And so we see how we make progress from there. Okay, can we all see my screen? Can you see my screen? If you can see my screen, please type 777 in the chat box, 777. I want everybody to participate, please. I only, I am better when I see people participating. Yeah, I know some people um, are busy but if you're on the call, just respond. It gives makes me feel, yeah, people are with me. So please, if you can hear me, you're on this call, type 777 in the chat box. Type 777 in the chat box. All right, okay, just um, by way of announcement, just to let us know, it will be sent later today. Um, we have a VIP group on the Telegram, on Telegram, and we're resuming subscription next week so i know we all we, we all attend or we tend to join two sessions and king david joined the hfx arena and he's being paid i know some of some of us might just feel he's just doing it for good reason. well he's been paid and so we decided to have um, a premium package or a subscription pack for members of the HFX Arena, which is $100 per month. But we are giving 50% discount to the first 100 persons. So, and as it stands, we are just, I think, 41 right now. So we're going to be resuming, we're going to start subscription next week from Monday. So we'll be added to a VIP group and payment will be retrieved. Because for us to sustain this, um, analysis, an analytical, I mean, um, strategies that are being used and analysis that are being used to call out trade are not free. They are being paid for. And King David himself isn't doing this for free. So please, um, just to let us know, we are going to be paying $50 monthly and will be added to the VIP group. So this free group, we only have maybe one signal sent to the group, but live sessions will not be on this free group anymore from Monday. So I just thought to let us know because announcements we made later will be sent out later. So please, um, if you know you get value and you still want to keep getting value, please make plans to subscribe. It is just, hundred dollar per month but you're having a fifty dollar discount fifty percent discount because you are one of the first hundred persons all right so we go ahead to look at the market now this is forest factory which is the news now you can see that two of our big currencies have bank holiday two of our big currencies have bank holiday euro has bank holiday, CHF has bank holiday. And um, 
yeah, we have news by 1.30 p.m. on card, and we have news by 1.30 p.m. on USD. Okay, so USD, card has two news by 1.30. USD has three news by 1.30. Then by 3 p.m., we have another news on USD that impacted the currency again. So we need to be cautious while trading. Remember I said that if the market is not ready to pay you, you leave the market. And that is what we did in the morning session. It was just two that aligned and we took those two and we left. Remember, you do not decide for the market. I mean, we cannot decide for the market. The bulls and the bears decide the market. I mean, we are, we are, we are not bulls. I mean, bulls, bulls trade. I mean, those are the banks. They trade in thousands and millions of dollars. So they determine the trend of the market. So the bulls and bears determine the trend of the market. So we cannot influence the market. So what we do is we wait for the market to make its decision, then we join in. That's basically what we do. We wait for the market to make a decision, then we join in and take our fair share and leave the market. But if the market is not aligning with our strategies, we leave the market. All right. So we've seen the news. That's the first thing you do. Just for, the, for, for those that are joining us for the first time, the first thing you do is check the news to be sure that you are seeing what is currently happening. So you don't treat a currency that has news that is impacting it negatively. I believe we are all following. So the next thing we do again is check the currency strength. So we use livechart.co.uk to check and see the currency strength of the currencies. So we see that JPY has four, five bars. GBP has one bar. Euro has two bars. USD has three bars. And you know the rule says you trade a strong currency against a weak currency. You trade a weak currency against a strong currency. So when you have a currency pair and you have USD, JPY, USD is the base currency. The base currency is the first currency which applies upward or which, which moves the price action upward. So the first currency of every currency pair moves the price action to itself upward. It's called the base currency. And the second currency on a pair is the quote currency. And the quote currency moves downward. The base currency moves upward. The quote currency moves downward. So when we have a pair as Euro JPY, Euro is moving upward. JPY is moving downward. Now, if we look at this currency strength, we see that CHF is five bars. CHF has news, bank holiday. So we need to be careful with that. JPY is full, it's five bars. GBP is one bar. So if we are trading the pair, GBP, JPY, let me ask Alex, because he's new here. If we are trading the pair, GBP, JPY, where do you think the price action will go towards? The price action actually will, will go towards JPY because JPY is stronger. JPY. Exactly. So that's, that's, okay. that's basic. That's fundamental analysis. That's basic, fundamental. Because JPY is strong, price must favor JPY. And the reason why we don't stay with just fundamental analysis is because the bears can just decide to change the trend of the market. And GBP can just shoot up. Yeah, it happens like that. I mean, we've seen it in action many times. So that's why we don't just rely on currency strength meter alone to take trades. If you do that, you cannot be sure. So, but then I also validate the currency strength meter with another currency strength meter. And that's finviz.ash. This is finviz here. <clears throat> now, what I do with finviz is to confirm if the currency that was said to be the strongest here is the same currency that is said to be the strongest here. I confirm the percentage of the strength. So now it is clear that JPY is strong. JPY is strongest here. JPY is strongest here. So I trade anything against JPY. I mean, anything with JPY. So I trade for JPY. Are we getting? I already confirmed that JPY is strong. Now CCHF is just 10.10. 10. JPY is 0.42. The, 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 the difference is much. So I trade for JPY against anything. 
Are we good with that? So let's let's look at our first our first pair. Our first what's it called? So I can look at AUD JPY. I can look at USD JPY. My first pair USD JPY. So USD is zero. JPY is 0. 0.40. And when you see a pair and the difference is 0. 0.20, you are good. 0. 0.20 is fine. Once the difference is 0. 0.20, so I can even trade JPY CHF JPY in favor of JPY. JPY is way stronger. But looking at this currency strength, you see that JPY is six bar, CHF is six bar. So naturally, just want to leave it. You don't just mess with it. So that's why we tend to validate with the two currency strength meter. Is it making sense? If it's making sense, you please put sense in the chat. If this is making sense to you, put sense in the chat. All right, great. So now let's look at our analysis or our, tech, um, our technical analysis. We've checked fundamental. We've seen what fundamental says. So we're looking at USDJP, which is our first pair. USDJP, which is our first pair. So like I said, the first thing I do is I chart. This market is already looking so good. It's looking so good, but let's still chart. So I chart the daily. I chart the daily. The market is on a downtrend, right? So I pick the week of the current day candle and the body of the previous day candle. Then I move to the early. Now, this is the week of the previous hour candle. This is the week of the current hour candle, but I'll leave it as one. Then I move to the 15 minutes. 15 minutes. Oh, guys, are you ready for USD JPY for a put? Our first idea, 804, USD JPY three to five minutes bearish reaction, USD JPY, JPY is strongest. So three to five minutes bearish reaction at the 804. Do we get that? Let me write that on the chart. Our first idea, possible three to five minutes bearish reaction on USD JPY at the 804 area. I know technical guys are already in the trade. Technical guys are already in the trade. I mean, that's fine. That's our first idea. That's our first idea. This guy has locked me out. That's our first idea. Who got in? If you're in, let me see your entry point. Remember our rules. You know, I'm supposed to go through the rules, but I believe everybody should know our rules. Remember our rules. Use our trades at three to five minutes, fixed time off. Three to five minutes, fixed time off, USD JPY. And our second rule says use good risk management. Good risk management. Do not over leverage. Who entered the trade already? Man, this guy is already pushing down. I'm not even. I'm not done setting up. All right, our zone is eight zero four, eight zero four, eight zero four. But if it comes up to this point, I want to go in on technical. Let me go in on one, one, one entry. I'm entering here, technically. Seven seventy five. Okay, somebody goes in at seven seventy five. That's good. That's good. That's good. Mm. So let's watch the market. Let's watch the market. Let's watch the market. So this is the eight, um, 10, 28. So in the next two minutes, there should be a reversal of this candle in the next two minutes. So technical guys, I know you're already inside the industry. Um, you want to wait, patient trader, you want to still wait. But if you want to go in, you can go in on this trade, but make sure you use minimal risk. Use 1% or 2%. The trade will tank. So if you want to go in now, you can go in. But make sure you use not more than 3% for it because everything is set. Everything is aligned. Right. Are we good? Are we together? So if you went into this trade, please let me see your entry point. Remember, I went in on a very low entry. I went at 769. This is our first trade idea. 
Who is bare on this idea? If you are bare on this idea, please put bear. If you are bare on this idea, please put bear in the chat. If you are bearish on this idea, please put bear in the chat. All right, just have some. It's, it's coming, price wants to come up. It wants to come up. Let's have some music. I want to take a call. So please watch the trade. If you took a lower entry like me, watch the trade. Oh, I'm sure. Let me clear first. All right, who has cleared? If you've cleared, please put clear in the chat. Clear, clear. Please put your green bubble in the Telegram group. Put your green bubble in the Telegram group. That's one on zero right now. That's one complete idea. You see, market still want to push upward. If you've not entered this trade, wait for it. If you've not entered, wait for it to get to 804 and you can go in. So I'm taking my first rule. Um, this guy should let me be now. All right, that's one, one on zero. The analysis was complete. I'm still in the trade though, I'm still in the trade. And I'll go in on another entry when it gets to 804. When it gets to 804, I'll go in again. Let me validate this, check the strength again. GPY drop one bar, but it's fine, it's fine. So while we wait on that, let's see. Please, let's put our, our green bubbles on the Telegram group, please. Let's do that, let's do that. If you've cleared or you cleared, put your green bubbles. Put your green bubbles. If you've not gone into the trade, don't worry. It's a complete analysis. Don't worry. Just wait for it to get to the zone. 804. Let me turn down this music. So yeah, if you're not in the trade, wait for it, wait for it, wait for it. Let it come there. Remember, you can take two rows. So I'm waiting for it to come if it comes up to that zone, I'll go in on my second entry. But on this entry, I've taken one rule. I will take another rule. Please, I want to say that if you're trading on my session, wait for zones if you're not a technical trader. Please. There are ways I trade. There are ways I trade mine. So I might enter four entries. So I entered a lower entry. That's why I've not cleared. I entered very low. That's why I've not cleared. Some people already cleared. So please note that, note that. All right, let's look at another idea. We can also look at 
AUDJPY. Hmm. Let's look at Euro JPY. Let's look at Euro JPY. Let's look at Euro JPY. Mm, Euro JPY, GDP, GBP, AUD. Market is really tricky. So I, I want to look at GBP. I want to look at GBP. Okay. Price has gotten there. So I'm taking my second. Sheesh. Pick me at 802. It went higher, guys. If you are not in, please, you want to go in on USDJPY. Markets will react. Markets will react. So please manage those trade. I have two entries now. Let me take my second rule on my first entry. Okay, let's look at GBP, JPY. Come on, what sort of movement is this? Wow. Let's quickly chat, let's quickly chat. Ooh, guys, so sorry, I'm on 15 minutes. Oh, wow, wow, wow. Wow, I'm on 15 minutes. So, 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 I didn't take notes. GBP, JPY, let's quickly look at the entry. Let's quickly chat. Let's, let me see if I need to take your role. Okay, it's already clearing. The trade is already tanking. Guys, if you are bare on USD JPY the second time, let me see. Let me see some 777 in the chat box. If you are bare on USD JPY the second time, let me see some 777 in the chat. If you are bare the second time, let me see some 777. All right, GBP JPY, our second idea, 694. GBP JPY, our second idea, 694. Good, 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 good. GBP, JPY, let me quickly write that out. GBP, GBP, JPY, 694. That's our second idea, GBP, JPY, it's coming, it's coming. It's coming. So my first entry, I wouldn't roll it over again. I'm taking a first roll and I'm taking a second roll. If I lose that trade, it's on me. If I lose that trade, it's on me, but it's okay. I mean, I'll definitely recover back, but I'm likely to clear it. So that's me trading technical, but our original zone is cleared. So guys, that is one complete analysis that has paid us two times. So we are officially one on zero on this call. Cleared, 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 great, 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 great. Please put your green bubbles in the chat. Put your green bubbles in the chat. Put your green bubble cleared. I want to see it on the, on the Telegram group, please. Go ahead on the Telegram group and put your green bubbles. Put your green bubbles, put your clears on the Telegram group as well. I want to see it. Guys, can you see this movement? Can you see this movement, right? So I'm likely going to clear my second entry. That's technical trading. I'm likely going to clear the second entry. If market does not tank, I mean, if it does not reverse. So please.
All right, guys, I'm back. Sorry, I had to just um, attend to somebody. Okay, so let's watch our second idea. Technical guys, I know you are in on GBP, JPY. Share, share. I'm supposed to have gone in. I'm supposed to have gone in on GBP, JPY, but it's okay. It's okay. Guys, can you see? Can you see? I took two rows and I'm clearing the second entry. If you follow the rules, you are likely to, I mean, keep making money and not lose any money. The only thing that can happen is if the market tanks, let's say the bulls get in play and the bulls pushes this market. But if the bulls do not push this market, I will clear this. You see, although sometimes you can just see all this, all this payward sensation. The, the, the price will just move upward like this. Yeah, that's the bull coming in play. But if not, I will clear this. Can you see that? Can you see that? So technical trading is trickish, but you just need to know what you're doing and make sure you see. So that's that's it. So I mean, $27, that's my second entry on the first idea. If you got two entries cleared on USDJPY, let me know in the chat. If you got USDJPY twice, if you got it twice, Put twice, put twice in the chat. If you got it twice, put twice in the chat. Wow, two on zero on UJ. Let me see your scores, please. Put your scores, put your scores. Put your scores. No, no worries, no worries, no worries. Put your scores on the Telegram group as well. I want to see it there. So I make reference to the Telegram group because I want us to grow the community. I want us to grow the community and it's Telegram. So anybody that joins the group sees all these messages, sees all of these things. So I want us to get used to it. I want us to really get used to using the Telegram channel. And I think USDJPY will pay us again. Let's quickly check. If you are having fun on this session and you are happy with this session, please put some sheesh in the chat. Put some sheesh in the chat. All right, we see GBP JPY. GBP JPY is coming there. I want to. Be, I just want to confirm again the strength. GBP JPY, GBP ten, JPY close is far apart. So GBP JPY, I want to go in on GBP JPY. Hold on, let me confirm US JPY as well. Let's see. Okay, US JPY has a new zone, which is eight thirty two. US JPY second, I mean third. Third entry, or I mean, second idea on USJPY, 832. USJPY. Then GBP, JPY. Where is it again? GBP, JPY. Okay, please make sure you go in for five minutes on GBP, JPY. It will reverse in the next, um, in the 45 minutes candle, GBP, JPY. So I'm going in on GBP, JPY for five minutes. All right. Three to five minutes, anyone, but it should not be less than. Three minutes. I can't see your sheesh. People are not clearing or what? I want to see it. I like to see it. You got two on O on one idea. That is sweet. That is sweet. So our second idea, GBP JPY. Who is in? If you are in GBP JPY, let me know. Then um, 808. US JPY is coming again. 808. 832. Let me write that out. US JPY. 832. So our third idea, 832. Come on, UJ, don't do that. Let us enter. Come and pick us. Come up and pick us before you move downwards. Come up. Can you see the momentum? It's going to go down. But let it come up and pick us. Let it come and pick us. Come up, pick us. Come up, pick us. Um, GJ, GJ, we should be getting ready to clear. If you took three minutes, you should be getting ready to clear. If you took three minutes on GJ. 
So let's just watch the market play. Let's watch it play. I want us to get on UJ again, but UJ is oh, already started. Already started. In my push up, if it pushes up to this point, 832 going. But if it does not get to 832, you're not going. You're not going. Let it go. It speed us twice, so it's fine. It's pushing down already, man. So sad. It would have been three. Okay. So let's see what else. What else? What else can play? Euro has news. He has bank holiday. So I'm trying to be careful on Euro because it's going to be working with the with the uh, what's it called with the strength of the previous day card. We can look at. Let me see where card is here. Let's look at Euro card. Let's look at Euro card. The difference is 20. Let's look at Euro card. But we're going to be very careful. We're going to be very, very careful. Who has cleared GJ? Who has cleared GJ? Sheesh. Who has cleared GJ? Who has cleared GJ? GJ cleared, nice, cleared, cleared. Please, I want to be seeing this clear on the Telegram group. I want to see this clear on the Telegram group. I want to see the clear on the Telegram group. So officially, two on zero. Two complete analysis, zero incomplete analysis. Please put your scores on the chat, on the Telegram group as well. Put your scores on the chat. Two on zero. Please put your scores on the chat. Are we, are we, I don't know, is it that we don't, we, we, Telegram is not like WhatsApp, so we don't just want to just go there. It's an app like WhatsApp. I want us to get used to using it. That is where everything will be sent. We're not going to be using the WhatsApp as such. We need to build this. We need to build this. I mean, it's not Discord. If it was Discord, I would say, okay, maybe Discord is maybe, maybe for tech people, but Telegram is just like WhatsApp. So please, let's go on Telegram and put our stuff there. We won't trade again. We won't trade again until I see it. We won't trade the game. Put your scores on the Telegram group. Put your scores. Put your scores. I want to see it. I like to see it. Put your scores. Put your scores. I want to see it. I like to see it. Can you see that movement? Oh, God. Let me do a video of this. Guys, you see, today's session, analysis don't lie, man. Can you see? Can you see where we entered? See, that's it clear. So we've, we've analyzed the market just two times and we've made profits three times, three times. So one of the currency pair paid us twice and one, I mean, one of the analysis paid us twice and one paid us again. So that's three on zero, my score. But officially, it is two, zero. Two zero two completed analysis and one incomplete analysis. Sheesh, I can see clear, see clear, 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 clear. I can see some sheesh. Two zero. Please let me see your scores. I want to see your scores. I mean, the score should be three zero, but our analysis is two. Two completed analysis. What's your score? I want to see your score. I want to see your score. I want to see it. I like to see it. Three zero, three zero. Nice, 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 nice. Three zero. I want to see your scores, guys. I want to see your scores. I want to see your scores. Okay, let's move ahead. Let's go ahead. So let's see what else. Let's see what else we can look at. JPY is waxing strong. JPY is waxing strong. It's just funny that we don't have pairs like Card GPY. We don't have pairs like me. GPY is really waxing strong. So let's see. Let's see. US GPY, just maybe, just maybe. Euro GPY. We've not checked Euro GPY, but let's look at. Reason why I'm, I'm skeptical about Euro is because of the news. I mean, the holiday. 
Euro has bank holiday. Euro has bank holiday. You have card JPY, really? Okay, okay, okay. That's um, pocket option. Okay, let's check card JPY for you. Card JPY. Do I even did I add that thing here? I don't think I added it here because it's not on our broker, so I didn't add it here. Okay, let me just add it. Card JPY. So guys, um, please, please let me know your scores. Let me know your scores. Only if people are responding. I want to be sure that everybody's taking this trade. These are good setup and we are profiting from them. It will be painful if some people are not profiting. So I really want to be sure that we are all profiting. If you've... Oh guys, sorry, my network spiked me out. So I just go back in now. Just go back in now. So I was, I was saying a thing. I said, I want to see your scores. Please put your scores in the chat. I want to be sure that we are all participating. I mean, we are making money. I want to be sure everybody, nobody's missing out on this. I want to be sure nobody's missing out on this. If you know you are taking this trade, if you know you are taking the trade, you're making profit, please let me know. Put your scores in the chat. Put your scores in the chat. Only a few people are responding. Okay. Officially two on zero. My score three on zero. It's okay. All right. Let's see if we can look at one more. I'm really very careful. You know we have news. So I'm really very careful. JPY, you let's see. One second, guys. All right. So I want to see what else we can look at. Euro JPY. Let me see. Let me see if it's if it's good. We can go in. I'm skeptical, but no, no, it's already selling. Can you see? It's already selling. If this was CBX, this would have been so much money. This movement would have been so much money. Well, maybe in future we'll get on TBX eventually, but for now, HFX. All right, let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. This is zero. I'll have said you would. GPU, you will USD, but USD and Euro is just 16. It has to be a minimum of 20 before you can pick those pair. AUD JPY, have we, have we looked at AUD JPY at all? Wow, how you come? can't see your screen. Sir. How come? JPY, my friend. Come on, already selling. Let's, 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 oh man, it's a good setup. How did I not check AUD JPY? You know, we can't see your screen. You said what? We can see your screen. I think when you had that spike. Oh, so sorry. Let me quickly share. Okay, can you see my screen now? Yes. Okay, great. ADJPY is one of my favorite pairs. I mean, my wife made me love ADJPY. She had faith in ADJPY, and instead of paying us, I, I don't trade it before now. I don't. And I mean, I've never lost ADJPY in recent time. So it's my friend. I didn't see this. If I'd seen it, we'll have gone in. I mean, we'll have secured the bag here. But let's 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 chat it. Price might come back there. What's the time? Okay, there will be a reversal by 11 o'clock in this next six minutes. So let's look capitalize on that timing. Let's see what we can use, what we can we can harness in the next see your JPY. Okay. So let's look at your JPY. Momentum is down actually, but let's see. Let's just quickly chart it. I'm going to be very careful because yeah, it's pushing up so we can capitalize on it in the next five minutes. There should be a reversal because it's currently working opposite. 
So let's quickly chat. On the daily, remember our chatting style, it's a downward movement, so you chart the week. So this is, this is it. You buy the floor of an uptrend and you sell the ceiling of a downtrend. I don't know how to say, let me explain that. The floor, every candle you see has a ceiling and has a floor, resistance and support. But I mean, I don't really use resistance and support. Some other educators use resistance and support. Some people use floor and ceiling. I prefer to use floor and ceiling. So I am going in for a downtrend. So I'm going to chart the ceiling of a downtrend. That's what it, that's how the way it works. You buy the ceiling of a downtrend and you, you sell, sorry, you sell the, the ceiling of a downtrend and you buy the floor of an up, uptrend. I don't know if you understand, if you get it, it's that simple. So that's why I'm charting the ceiling of a downtrend. Now, so I charted the daily candle and I'm charting the previous day candle. And I'm also charting the week of the daily candle. Then I move to the one hour. The one hour, this is the previous hour candle and this is the current hour candle, still pushing. So let's just leave the last one. Then I come to the 15 minutes. Okay, this is a zone. Technical guys, you want to run, run in, but I wait for it. 7.99 guys. It's going to tank. The, the, see, this trade is for the next timing. It's for the 11 o'clock timing. So please, thank you guys, if you are going in, watch your trade. Euro JPY, I'm going at 7.99. So that's our third idea. Euro JPY. Possible three to five minutes bearish reaction on Euro JPY. At the 799 area. Remember, there is a holiday on Euro, so you want to be careful. You don't want to just jump. Let it get to the zone that we charted. So we don't speak in tongues while we are waiting. Euro JPY 799. Euro JPY 799. Now, this is it. This is where it's currently trying to push in here. So, but technically, I will enter technically. Then, when it pulls back up, Hey, GBP, GBP, I want to pay us again, guys. <laughs> Let me quickly check that. GBP, JPY. I'm going in on GBP, JPY right now. Five minutes. I want to check USD, JPY as well. Okay, seven. Then Euro, JPY. So I'm going on Euro, JPY. One entry right now. Euro, JPY. I'm going on one entry on Euro JPY. So I'm on 772. That's my entry. But I would enter another entry if it pushes upward. So if it gets to our original zone, I will enter again. So 799 is our original zone. I got in on GJ. I got in on GJ. Anybody also entered GJ? Anybody entered GJ? GJ will tank. Okay, let me give us a zone for GJ. Let me give us a zone for GJ. GJ. Okay, GJ has broken that particular point. So what's the problem? Let me see. GJ 23, 23, 43, 20. The difference is 20. If you are not on GJ, don't worry, don't enter. If you're not on GJ, don't enter. Don't enter, except you want to wait for it to be zone. This is the next zone, 173, and it's so far. If you're not on GJ, do not enter GJ. Do not enter GJ. So let's think the three. If you're not on GJ, do not enter GJ. It broke that zone we charted, so it's pushing up. So I'm just going to manage my GJ. I'm going to what's the what's the zone for Euro JPY? Because it's at seven ninety two now. Sorry, hold a second. Let me take a roll on this. I sent it on the group now. I sent it on the group. Please check the group. Uh, this is GJ. Let me see. Let me take one road on GJ. Then you're talking of UJ. Was it UJ? No, EJ. So EJ is 799, 799, 799, 799. That's the zone. 799 for itself. Started already. Started already. Who got in on 
EJ. Who got in on EJ? So you see, the timing is one of the sweetest thing about HFX. We know there will be a reversal. Okay, this is it. It's not like it's magic or a secret. There is always a reversal at the 30 minutes candle. So when it is 10.30, there must be a reversal. When it is 10.45, there must be a reversal. When it is 11 o'clock. So at the o'clock, at the hourly, at the 15 minutes, and at the 45 minutes. That's why you see when I'm chatting. When I chat, I chat daily. I chat hourly, I chat 15 minutes, and I chat five minutes. So there's always a reversal at half an hour, 45 minutes, and the hourly. So please, EJ has gotten to that zone, it would reverse. There's no way. So please manage it. It got to that zone, manage it. If you need to take rule, take rule. I entered at the lower entry, so I might need to take a rule. But let's see, let's see it play out. I need to take a rule, EJ. And the reason why EJ is pushing is because EJ is not being traded today because there's bank holiday. So I just went into EJ, I just went into it. But then it's okay, just make sure you take a rule. It would react, it would react. So let me watch GG. Okay, guys, do not let it go. Do not let any of this trade go. Do not let any of this trade go. Do not let any of this trade go. GJ is pushing down. It's pushing down. If you're on the trade, let me know. Let me know if you're on the trade and what's your entry point. If you're on the trade, let me know. Let me know your entry points. We're gonna take a roll. Remember, you can take two, on my session, you can take two rolls. You can take two rules. Okay. EJ is pushing. It's pushing beyond that zone. Something is wrong. Something is wrong. This reaction is not okay. Let me see what's happening. So it's gone past 799, which we charted. Ooh. Euro has gained some strength. Before 20 was the difference. Now it's less than 20. But it's okay. There should be a reversal. Whoops. Guys, can you see this? Can you see? If you've taken one rule, let it go. I mean, currency flipped on us. The analysis was correct. But currency flipped on us. Can you see euro was just too bad? Now euro is over JPY. Can we see what I'm saying? If you can see what I'm saying, please let me know. Say yes, put yes in the chat because we are learning as well. We are learning. So this is the perks of trading when there is news. Some people know how to trade against the news, right? I didn't expect this kind of movement. I didn't expect it's too much. Even if it was supposed to increase just one bar, but it went above AUD, I'm sorry, above JPY. So JPY actually lost strength as well. JPY lost strength. That's okay. That's okay. So let me wait for GJ. See, GJ is also, is also doing this. All right. If you're on EJ, if you're on EJ, just let it complete. If you're taking a first rule, it's okay. It might come down. But we cannot, our analysis cannot help us because, because of the news that is on it. So it flips beyond our analysis. It flips beyond our analysis. So, but yes, the analysis is correct. What we charted is correct. The impact is because of the news on Euro. That's why. See, it has gone back one bar. So it will keep fluctuating that way. So let's stay away from Euro. There's bank holiday. Are we understanding the flow are we seeing the way the market moves are we understanding how the market is going back and forth how news is impacting it see this is the reason why i said you cannot only rely on fundamental analysis to take a trade you would lose your money if you rely only on fundamental analysis and that is what is playing out here if we had relied on just see it's just this guy was six bar went to five bar went to four bar now the same strength with aud and the same strength with euro 
Come on. So it's a lesson. It's a lesson. Can you see Euro now? Euro has added one by again. Are we following? Are we learning? If you're getting value, please type value in the chat. I want to see it. If you're getting value, please type value in the chat. I want to see everybody type value. If you get value, if you're getting value, please put value in the chat. Please put value in the chat. If you are getting, <laughs> somebody cleared EG. How? That means you took a very high entry. Somebody cleared it. Yeah. I just want to risk it. I'm taking my second rule. I want to just see it play out. Oh, it's gone. It's gone. It's gone. It's gone. So that's a lesson. Because I, I, I can't, I don't know what will happen, except the market plays opposite and it favors us. But the strength is in favor of you right now. Please, are we getting value from this? Is it making sense? Did we learn? Did we learn from this? Are we learning from this? Did we learn? Is it making sense? Did we did we take value from it? I want to be sure we took value. If you took value from this that just played out in the market, please, I want to see value. I'm only seeing just four persons. I want to see value in the chat. Are we on this call? Are we on this call? I really want to see value. I want to see it. I want to see it. It's a lesson. You've gotten value already. That's a lesson that do not trade the news. Do not trade. Don't bother. Man. It can only be magic. Market just overturned. The way it overturned. That's the way we can clear it. I mean, see what it's doing. If it does that and keep doing that and it comes down, fine. But I tell you, it is risky. So, guys, market is somehow today from morning is in somehow. So I think we're going to call it a day. We go again tomorrow at 10 a.m. Let me see your scores, please. Let me see your scores. Let me see your scores. I want to see your scores. I want to see your scores. My score is currently 5-1. If this goes, that'll be 5-2. It's painful. 4-0. Whoa, 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 whoa. 4 on 0. Well, our analysis is correct. We have three complete complete analysis. The three analysis was complete completed. It's just market that spiked us. So analysis is correct. So officially we are three zero officially. But my score is five on one, two one, three one. Let me see your scores. Don't worry. Put it. Put it. Is to is to help us know where we are. Put your scores. If it's zero one or zero two or zero five, put it. Put the score. Let's see it. Let's see it. Let's see your scores. We got value. That's the most important thing. We got value. Even if we took one lesson, but we got value. Now, the lesson is not due to the analysis. Our analysis is correct. The lesson was due to the news. Because we did we ignored the news. That was why we took that lesson. But analysis is correct. Two, two. Wow. No problems. That's okay. That's okay. So, so it's okay. That's fine. I want to see our scores. I want to see our scores. My score is now 5-2. Guys, can you see? So if I'm taking a second rule, I might just have cleared it. But I didn't want us to just take that. I mean, it's, it's, it's wrong. Once there's a news on a currency, just leave it alone. That's the lesson. Once there's a news on a currency, just leave it alone. If I'm taking it, I would have taken a second rule. I wanted to take a second rule, but it didn't allow me to take a second rule. If I'm taking a second rule, I might have cleared it. I might have cleared it. Somebody even cleared EG. You see, some people, that's to tell you that the analysis is correct. So officially, we are three on zero. Officially, we are three on zero. Can you see, guys? Can you see how the market is playing? You don't, you, it's a lesson. Don't bother. Let me refresh and see. It has gone back down. It has lost one more strength. Are we following? Are we following? Please, I want to be sure that we are getting value. It's not about trading alone. It's about understanding how the market works. It's about understanding how the market works. So before we go, before we go, um, tomorrow, tomorrow, our session is 10 a.m. We're not going to be having King David because the sessions are Monday, um, Tuesdays, Wednesdays, and, and Thursdays, 6 a.m. 
my session Mondays to Fridays, 10 a.m. So if you've gotten value from these, if you've gotten value from this, please put value before you leave. Put value before you leave. If you've gotten value from this session, put value on the chart before you leave. Put value on the chart before you leave. Then also go to the Telegram group and share your scores. Announcements will be sent on the Telegram group today and how we can join the VIP. Like I said, we are using phones to run this community. Bringing King David, I mean, I've been calling trades for about a year and I've not charged a penny from anybody. That's because I want us to grow together. But now we are expanding and growing this particular community and we need more people. So and they are not coming in for free. So that's why we are adding subscription to the membership. So and the subscription is just $100. The subscription is just $100. Be, be honest, I mean, if you're honest with yourself, $100 in a month is not too much for the value and the money you are making except you don't follow the rules and you lose money. This week alone, yesterday was 10 on zero. Yesterday was 10 on zero. That's my session and King David session. Two days ago was eight on one. Three days ago was, eight on, was nine on one. And Monday was four on one. So we've just taken one, two, three. We've taken just two lessons, Mondays, to Thursday, we've taken just two lessons, Monday to th Thursday, yeah, no, sorry, three lessons. And we've had 10, eight, eight. We've had 26. Okay, I've never added today, plus today, that is 29, 29 on three. And we still have Friday, 29 on three. So I don't think $100 is too much, for us but like we said we are giving 50 percent discount to the first 100 people the first 100 people so all you are doing is 50 dollars you are only paying 50 dollars so guys that's it the announcement will be sent later today i'll see you guys tomorrow enjoy the rest of your day and if you have friends i mean share this opportunity with them it's a way to make more if we grow the community to a point, we can bring Matitea on our session. We can bring him. So long as we're able to pay him, we can bring him. We can bring any educator, Genesis educator, IM educator, Mind Valley educator. We can bring any of these guys so long as we are able to pay them. And that's the reason why we are growing the community. That's the reason why we are trying to grow the community. Let's just be beyond here. I mean, sooner or later, we're going to have our own platform, our own website, and our own portal as well. So we are growing this community. We are growing this vision. So please make it a point of duty, make it a point of responsibility to stay on the Telegram group. Invite people, let people know about it. The free group is free. Anybody can join the free group. But the VIP group, I mean, when you are, your payment is confirmed, then you'll be added to the VIP group. So from next week, Monday, the free group will just have signal. No, um, what's it called? Um, live session so the link will be sent only on the vip group and it's definitely going to be a different link so guys that's the information and i hope it sits well with you and i hope we continue securing the bag as we are doing honestly the hfx arena is here to stay and myself and king david were discussing this morning and we are looking to bring in tbx so trust me it's going to be amazing. It's going to be amazing. And that would cost money as well. So that's why we just introduce membership fee. We introduce membership fee. So I hope this information sits well with you. And I'll see you all tomorrow. Thank you, everybody. And enjoy the rest of your day. Bye.